today we're going to take a look at the quick draw filter from Platypus. This is the quick draw filter from Platypus. I opted for the filter and reservoir combo which cost me $48 US. On the outside of the box you'll see a couple of claims that we need to test. Claim 1 is that the filter weighs 3.3 ounces, and claim 2 is that it can filter 3 liters of water a minute. Before we get to the test, let's take a look inside the box where we'll see the quick draw filter and the 1 liter reservoir. So the feature that makes this filter unique is that it seals up on both ends. So after I'm done using it, I can just close it up and throw it in my bag, and I won't need to worry about it getting my gear wet. On the dirty end of the filter, you'll see what looks like a proprietary coupling for platypus reservoirs, but there are also 28 millimeter threads. So this will work with a wide range of water bottles as well as the 28 millimeter version of the c -Noc Vecto. Bone dry and out of the box, the quick drop comes in at 2.3 ounces, which is well below the advertised 3.3 ounces. However, after looking at the instructions, you're supposed to dampen the filter by filtering one liter of tap water before leaving on a trip. So after prepping the filter for use, it weighs three ounces. Next, let's test the flow rate of the quick draw. I filled up the one liter platypus reservoir and applied steady pressure. If the claim on the box is correct, it should filter this in an impressive 20 seconds. And it wasn't even close at seven minutes, 14 seconds. So that's a serious downgrade for my Sawyer Mini, which took three minutes, 40 seconds for the same amount of water. Assuming I had a defective filter, I contacted Platypus Support and opened a warranty claim. I received this response from them. Very high volume of requests? 12 weeks? Well, clearly they sell a very high volume of defective gear. So at this point, I can't personally recommend this filter, but I'll keep you up to date on what happens. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next Tuesday.